Hi, I'm David Carnoy from CNET.com and this is the Sennheiser Urbanite XL Wireless, one of the better sounding Bluetooth headphones on the market. It carries a list price of $300 and currently only comes in black, but more color options should arrive in the future. Sennheiser's Urbanite line is designed to have a little more urban flair to it and appeal to the Beats audience. This model looks very similar to last year's wired Urbanite XL that we liked, but this model gives you the option of going either wired or wireless and has touch controls on the right ear cup. Tap the side of the headphone once and your music pauses, tap it twice and you advance a track forward. You swipe up and down to control volume. Some people don't like these types of touch controls because you can end up accidentally touching the side of the headphone and interfering with music playback. But the touch controls worked well for me, although I did have a few accidental pauses along the way. As far as other extras go, you get aptX, which is supposed to offer enhanced Bluetooth streaming with smartphones that support it and dual microphones so you can hear your voice in the headphones when you're using the headphone as a cell phone headset. This model does not feature active noise cancelling like the Beats Studio Wireless and Sennheiser's more expensive Momentum Wireless, but sound isolation is quite decent and the headphones are comfortable to wear. Battery life is rated at a strong 25 hours of music playback and the headphones do come with a two-year warranty. While made mostly of plastic, they do have metal hinges and seem sturdily built and fold up into a more compact form factor. They come with a carrying pouch, but it's pretty skimpy, which is a little disappointing. The sound quality isn't, however. As I said, this is one of the best sounding wireless headphones and may even sound better than the more expensive Momentum Wireless, depending on your audio taste. This is a very dynamic headphone with very clean sound for Bluetooth and good tight bass. The bass isn't as huge as Sennheiser says it is, and this is actually a fairly well-balanced headphone with a pretty warm mid-range. While the Urbanite XL Wireless isn't cheap at $300, it's cheaper than other premium Bluetooth headphones, and overall, I think it's a pretty decent value when you factor in its good build quality, comfort level, and very strong performance. Its design may not appeal to everyone, but it's an excellent Bluetooth headphone. I'm David Carnoy. Thanks for watching.